All right, guys, I just uh, put in my latest program here on MS2. And uh, I'm going to start the car and go for a quick little spin. It's running pretty good today. Um, I have really no glitches, just a little low on power. So I uh, backed off a little bit on the fuel and increased the timing a little bit on the lower end. So let's see what, what happens.
Back from the uh, the trip, and I just wanted to run one short video here over the engine bay. It's totally complete. I put the cross brace in, bolted it up today. It definitely made a difference in the in the handling of the car and the bumps it, in the front end. It definitely feels uh, like the suspension works better now. That the uh, that brace is there. The suspension soaks up the bump rather than the I guess the frame flexing it seems to work. Um, and uh, everything's good. I had to run a little piece of hose here that's just temporary to the uh, fast idle from the old J pipe that had that port there. I blocked it with the plug and the plug popped off and uh, you know when I boosted. So basically I just took that hose and connected it to the cold air idle thing and uh, they're both under boost anyway at the same time so that hose just I guess inflates or whatever but I'll do something more permanent eventually. And the uh, I'm running with the oxygen sensor strapped to the uh, brake uh, valves, brake, uh, brake master cylinder because I think it's close enough now to get that oxygen sensor in there. I think the tune is close enough where I won't foul that thing. Obviously it's running pretty good so probably during a week I'll uh, let that thing start to modify my maps automatically. Put it in automatic mixture control and let it tweak my maps. Alright, I'm going to go uh, upload this video to Google and I'll post it on there later. Talk to you guys.